It seems like everyone's going organic these days, but is it all hype? Let's bust some myths and get to the truth about organic food. Check out more details using the link in the description. Myth number one, organic farms are always free from synthetic chemicals. The notion that organic farms are entirely free from synthetic chemicals is a widespread myth that needs to be debunked. Organic farms are allowed to use certain natural pesticides and fertilizers derived from natural sources like plants, minerals, and microorganisms. While these inputs are generally considered safer than synthetic ones, they can still have negative environmental impacts. In fact, recent study shows that the presence of pesticide residues in organic samples is approximately five times lower than in conventional samples. This indicates that while not completely free from chemicals, Organic crops generally have significantly lower concentrations of pesticide residues compared to conventional crops. Myth number two. Organic food is always healthier. Organic farming aims for healthy soil, but it doesn't automatically make food more nutritious. Studies show minimal differences in nutrients between organic and conventional foods. Focus on a balanced diet with a variety of foods, organic or not. Myth number three. Organic farming is always more expensive. Organic can be pricier, but not always. Organic products can vary in price due to factors like labor-intensive methods and smaller farms. However, organic is becoming more accessible and affordable as the industry grows. Myth number four, organic food is always safe. While organic farming minimizes synthetic pesticide use, there's a myth that organic food is 100% risk-free. The truth is, some organic pesticides derived from natural sources can still pose health risks if misused or consumed in high quantities. Organic foods can also face contamination risks. The key here is to maintain a balanced perspective. Organic foods are generally safer than conventional counterparts, but not immune to all potential hazards. As with any food, practice proper safety and make informed choices. Myth number five, organic farms. Always use natural pest control methods. Organic farmers do prioritize natural pest control methods like crop rotation and beneficial insects. However, they can also use physical barriers like row covers or traps, and even approved natural pesticides as a last resort. Myth number six, organic food is always locally produced. Organic refers to farming practices, not location. An organic apple grown across the country is still organic, even if it's not local. Supporting local food systems can be good for the environment, but it's not directly linked to the organic label. Myth number seven, organic food is always free from GMOs. USDA organic regulations prohibit GMOs, but the certification focuses on farming practices, not testing for GMOs. While highly unlikely, there's a remote possibility of unintended contamination from nearby GMO crops. Look for non-GMO project verified for extra assurance. Before we continue to the next food myth that many people are wrong about, don't forget to give us a like, comment, and subscribe, as well as turn on the notification bell for future updates. Also, don't forget the link in the description for more organic food myths. Myth number eight, organic food is always more nutritious. Another common myth surrounding organic food is the belief that it's inherently more nutritious than conventionally grown options. But is this really the case? The truth is, the nutrient levels in organic foods can vary significantly depending on a variety of factors, including soil quality, growing conditions, and specific farming practices. A comprehensive study by Stanford University researchers analyzed 237 studies comparing the nutrient content of organic and conventional foods. They found little significant difference in most nutrients, with the exception of slightly higher phosphorus levels in organic produce. Rather than focusing solely on the organic label, consider the overall quality and variety of your diet from diverse food sources for optimal nutrition. Myth number nine, organic food is always free from additives. When you think of organic food, you might envision fresh, unadulterated produce straight from the farm. But the reality is that some organic foods may contain additives like preservatives, coloring agents, or flavor enhancers. Now don't get me wrong, the use of additives in organic foods is regulated and limited compared to conventional products. Organic regulations prohibit the use of certain synthetic additives and emphasize minimally processed ingredients. However, some organic processors may still use approved natural additives like citric acid, 
ascorbic acid, or natural flavors in their products. The key is understanding which specific additives are permitted and making informed choices based on your personal preferences and dietary needs. Myth number 10, organic food is always more environmentally friendly. A major selling point of organic is its eco-friendliness. And while organic practices generally have a lighter environmental footprint, it's a myth to claim organic food is always and universally more sustainable. Like any agricultural system, organic farming can still contribute to issues like deforestation, soil erosion, and water pollution if not managed responsibly. For example, some organic farms may rely heavily on tillage, which can degrade soil quality over time. Taking a holistic life cycle view is key to supporting the most eco-friendly practices. By doing so, you can make more informed choices that truly align with your values and support the most sustainable practices possible. Myth number 11. Organic farms always use composting. Composting is encouraged and widely used in organic farming, but it's not a universal requirement for organic certification. Organic farmers may use other sustainable soil management techniques. Myth number 12. Organic farms always use integrated pest management, IPM. IPM principles generally align with organic farming, but not all organic farms employ strict IPM practices. Some may rely more heavily on cultural controls, while others may incorporate natural pesticides or biological controls. Myth number 13. Organic farms always use cover crops. Cover cropping is a sustainable practice encouraged in organic farming, but not all organic farms use it. The decision depends on factors like crop rotation and farm management strategies. Myth number 14. Organic farms always use organic seeds. One of the core tenets of organic farming is the use of organic seeds, seeds that have been cultivated without the use of synthetic fertilizers, pesticides, or genetically modified organisms, GMOs. However, it's a persistent myth that all organic farms exclusively use organic seeds. In reality, the use of organic seeds in organic farming operations can vary for a variety of reasons. Availability, cost, and adaptability to local growing conditions can all factor into a farmer's decision to use organic or non-organic seeds. While organic regulations do encourage the use of organic seeds whenever possible, there are provisions that allow for the use of non-organic, untreated seeds in certain circumstances, such as when organic seed varieties are not commercially available. Myth number 15. Organic farms always use regenerative agriculture. Regenerative agriculture is a holistic approach that aligns with many organic farming practices, but not all organic farms use regenerative techniques. Myth number 16. Organic food is always free from contaminants. A major selling point of organic is being free from contaminants like pesticides and heavy metals. However, the idea of organic as 100% contaminant-free is a myth. While minimizing inputs, organic still faces inadvertent risks like drift from conventional farms. Recent research highlights that the assumption of organic wastes and safe organic wastes in organic farming is misleading. Even though organic farming practices are designed to reduce contaminants, there is still a possibility of contamination from various sources. By being aware of potential sources of contamination and taking reasonable precautions, consumers can make informed choices about mitigating their exposure while still enjoying the benefits of organic foods. Finally, myth number 17. Organic food is always free from irradiation. Irradiation is a controversial practice approved for use on certain food products even organic ones. Understand the implications and make informed choices aligned with your values. So those are the 17 organic food myths that many people are wrong about. Organic farming is not a one-size-fits-all system. The organic label doesn't guarantee superiority or absolute safety. Consider the whole picture. Soil health, growing conditions, processing methods, and overall nutrition. Stay informed and make well-rounded decisions that support your values. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more food and sustainability insights. Also, don't forget the link in the description.